We left Gibraltar this morning and we are now at Estepona. It's another beautiful Spanish city with a lot of flowers and planters everywhere and colorful houses. We just moored at the marina and it was our first Mediterranean mooring with Makani. It was different but during our sailing course we moored like a million times so the boat is fine and now we are celebrating. Tomorrow we will continue and then we will see how far we get because actually we are already on the way to our winter home base here in Andalusia. So yeah, good night and see you again early tomorrow morning. The good thing about arriving in the Mediterranean Sea is that we now have more options. For example, our trip started in Estepona, but we didn't know how far we would sail that day. With an anchorage or marina every few miles, we were finally able to relax and to be spontaneous about our next destination. To us. Being able to stay out at sea for as long as we like and not worrying about long passages and sailing overnight is a big relief and the change that we have been waiting for. We just arrived at Malaga and we decided to drop the anchor to save some money. It's a little bit rolly, but since we are only staying one night, we didn't really want to go into another marina again. We are not sure where we will sail to tomorrow, but we are thinking about the Marina del Este near Grenada. It looks amazing, we just looked it up on Google. It is very beautiful with rocks everywhere and we really would love to check that out. It might be expensive though, because it looks a bit posh, but yeah, we thought, why not? After all, we deserve a little treat now that we have finally made it to the Mediterranean Sea. The Elboran Sea is the westernmost part of the Mediterranean Sea. It lies between the Iberian Peninsula and the north of Africa. 
surface currents influenced by the prevailing winds flow eastward and bring water from the Atlantic into the Elboran Sea. As a result of this exchange of water, there is typically a vertical rotary circulation in this area. This information was brought to you by Wikipedia, but we actually experienced these surface currents and were surprised how much they slowed the boat down. The marina turned out to be the most beautiful port we have ever been to. It was very quiet, well protected and the impressive landscape with crystal clear water surrounding the marina made our short visit very enjoyable. So this is the last sail of this sailing season. We made it all the way to the Mediterranean Sea. We are now still in Spain um, and we are on the way to our winter marina. We will be there for several months uh, without worrying about the weather, without yeah, just taking a break. We are now getting really excited to work on the boat again. And yeah, it's a really beautiful day today. It's very calm. We don't have any wind or the wind is a little bit from the wrong direction but we are motoring and yeah the water is blue, the sky is nice, there are a few clouds but yeah we really enjoy it and we're really uh, excited that this is now um, yeah the last of it. It's so strange that you can't really see the horizon today, but it looks really cool actually. <laughs> also, how good does the boat look there behind me? I'm like on the pole position here, right on the bow. So it looks really good from here. I've never filmed it like that before. So <laughs> good idea. just arrived at the marina and Max is now checking us in and then we will find out uh, where we need to go and where the boat will be for the winter 
and then we will dock there and then we can finally relax and do nothing for a change and we don't have to go anywhere we don't have to check the weather we don't have to yeah <laughs> think about anything for a change and yeah then we can take a walk on the beach maybe and check the surroundings here thanks for watching Subscribe and join us next time for a big and exciting announcement. And no, I am not pregnant. See you.